Hi there, welcome to my studio. I want to talk today about the stages of learning because these lessons are for you wherever you are on your journey of painting. I came across an anonymous quote a number of years ago that speaks to the stages of learning and it goes like this, unconscious incompetence. We don't know what we're doing and we don't even know it. And then conscious incompetence. We know that we don't know what we're doing. And then conscious competence. We kind of know what we're doing. And then finally, unconscious competence. We know what we're doing. We don't even have to think about it and it just flows. The next thing that I want to talk about is this little triangle that I like to think about in terms of my teaching and also my painting. I think about my skills and my knowledge as this kind of triangle of elements that sort of swim together. And at the base of the triangle, the foundation of it is um, the science of what I'm doing. There's chemistry, there's um, visual perception, all those kind of sciencey things that I sort of need to take into account. And then at the other um, corner of the triangle are, is the craft of what I'm doing. Color, composition, um, perspective, things that I can learn from books and uh, that I've learned in art school and that I can pass on to you. And then at the top of the triangle is this other little bit more intangible, the art, the poetry of what we're doing, right? And most of the time when I'm working, I feel like I'm slugging away down here at the base of the triangle. And not to say that I can't create very worthy works of art there, but every now and then I get up there to that special poetry and something just paints itself and it's like magic. And that's what really gets me going back and back to my easel, really pulls me. So um, how do we, how do we get there lots and lots? Well, obviously we need to go to the easel lots and lots. We need to put in mileage.